We're talking customer success with David Rodman, celebrating the good times with Zach Nelson, and opening data centers in EMEA. Hold your calls, it's time for NetSuite Now. Let's get to know NetSuite's new EVP of customer success, David Rodman. No relation. So David, where are you from? I was actually born in Zimbabwe and then moved to South Africa to get educated. Any hobbies? One of the funnest things I do on, on a weekend is my daughter's into horse riding. So I just sit there and watch her groom the horse and then ride for an hour and a half and then after that we go for breakfast. So that's just a nice block of time where we just get really quality time together. Tell us a little about the customer success team. The first and foremost goal that we have is to ensure that our customers are successful. Our customers have a vision on what they want to do with their business. We would start with a client, uh, understand their business strategies and goals, but then look at the, bi the business processes uh, that will allow us to enable those goals. And we have the tools, we have the technology, the software, um, and we can do that for them. Join David for the Ask the Leader webcast on November 17th. Check the flyer and your email for more details. Thanks for your time, David. The holidays are a time for giving thanks, and we know how tricky that can be for some people. Cash? <laughs> or you my uncle? So we wanted to remind everyone to check out Sweet Deals. All NetSuite employees get a great discount on many items, all from companies who are achieving their business visions using the NetSuite platform, including NHD, Dell, Jawbone, and much more. Show them how much you really care by checking out Sweet Deals. 17 years ago, we were founded on a bold idea. Create a new kind of business system that allows companies the flexibility to grow, scale, and succeed. And it all started in a little office above a hair salon. We caught up with Zach Nelson to tell us more about how far NetSuite has come and why we should be celebrating our success. It's great to walk down memory lane and see where we've come from, but also know all of these capabilities that we have to leverage going forward. We've had four or five classes now of people that have worked at NetSuite for, for 10 years, and I think it says, a lot about the company we've built, uh, a lot about the customers we serve, and more importantly, a lot about the people who work at NetSuite. I think the value that we have around our customers and committing to their success with NetSuite and enabling their vision of their business on our platform is probably one of the most exciting reasons to be at NetSuite. But I think it's very important for us to reach our mission and re reach, reach our goals to share those stories with each other so that we continue to have breakthroughs, we continue to innovate across the product, across the service, across the organization, uh, and how we're organized. And there's no better way to celebrate success than to thank a colleague with Sweet Achievers. You can always send a Sweet Achievers award to anyone working here at NetSuite. Go to OKTA and click on Sweet Achievers. Hey, we've got a ton of achievements happening in EMEA. Last month, NetSuite hosted the Sweet Cloud Tour at Emirates Stadium in London, England to discuss today's most transformational business models and to find the next phase of disruption in a modern cloud-centric world. EMEA is home to more than 700 NetSuite employees and continues to be one of the strongest performing regions in terms of overall sales. And one more thing, we're proud to announce our first ever European data centers in Amsterdam and Dublin. We all love our food, but let's be honest, what's a good meal without a good condiment? It's no secret that founder and CTO Evan Goldberg loves his peanut butter. But we wanted to know what other condiments NetSuite employees are loving these days. My favorite condiment is horseradish. Probably ketchup. Red chili flakes. Any spicy spice. A great aged balsamic vinegar. For those of us, you know, that came from South Africa or Australia, I do like Vegemite or Marmite. Thousand Island dressing. Uh, I love pickle. Salt and pepper is good. Sriracha. So we have the Pinoy spice. This is actually Vinegar with lots of spices. And then on a Friday, sometimes we bring out the good stuff. That's all for now. As always, you can get all this info and more on the flyer. Until next time, this has been NetSuite Now.